Hello, internet. How are you guys doing? I haven't been on this channel in so long. Oh my gosh, it's killing me. Oh my gosh. I, sorry, guys. I've been so busy. I recently started golf and then pool and family stuff and relationship stuff and stuff like that. And, um, I'm here with a video and today's video is going to be my biggest fears. So, let's get started. Okay, so number one is being alone. Like, I don't really mind, but, like, I want to have someone that will, you know, be there. And I just don't want to be alone. And I'm a very independent person, but I just don't want to be alone. It's just scary, and it's just like you're a loner, and I don't, I don't want that. Number two, um, dying. I'm afraid, of, I'm afraid of dying, but a lot of people say, no, it's a natural thing, it just happens. It's, I, it's just one of, these are like my top, fe um, biggest fears, and I don't want to die. Like, why did, why does that, why did, why can't we just live forever? Like, why can't we? Like, it's just not fair. It's not fair at all, and death is a horrible thing, and it's, I've been through so many deaths, and it's just death, 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 <laughs> and it's just a scary thing, and I don't want to die, but it's a natural thing, I know I shouldn't be afraid, but it's just one of my top fears. Number three, um, I am... Of spiders. I'm absolutely terrified of them. And um, one time um, I was sleeping and um, I woke up and I felt something on me and it was a spider and I saw it. I saw it crawling on my arm. Like, on my arm, I saw it. And then I told my family. Probably just a dream, but it wasn't. I saw it with my own two eyes. You guys believe me, right? Would you guys believe me? But I was about to go downstairs, sleep on the couch. Then my dad came home, and he's like, "So, you found a spider?" I'm like, "Yeah, I'm serious." And it was it was terrible. Number four. Um, I, one of my biggest fears is losing this one one. And, um, it's been my fear for a long time. Sorry, my squeaky chair. Um, this dog has been in my life for, since, since I was three. And, um, she was my aunt and uncle's dog. And, um, every I would go over to their place. Um, she wouldn't. She wouldn't come down. You know, but she she's a very timid dog. And every time I would come over, she would come up. And um, she's the only, pretty much the only one that listens to me. She like, uh, I'm her favorite. And um, yeah. So um, if you guys wanna more details about her. Um, I have a, if you look through my um, videos, I have a, um, a dog, um, I did a dog tag about her, and, um, she is 10, she's 10 years old now, she's old, um, but yeah, I'm just very afraid, because losing, losing animals is way different than losing humans. listen and they don't talk back and they're always there for you and I just don't want this little baby to go she's my baby girl and I love her right yeah yeah so yeah, I'm just afraid to lose this little girl but you know she's just trying to like 
am terrified to lose my family because if they all die before me, um, I will have no one. I'll have no one, honestly. And it's just very terrifying. And um, it's just been on my mind. And it's just always been in my fears. And, um, but you know, it's just part of life. And, um, yeah. Number six, um, um, I am afraid, I am, I, I'm sorry guys, I have so many fears, um, I am scared to lose this one. Uh, she's been my best friend since fourth grade, we have the same birthday, yes, and, um, we're like best buds, we're like this, we're so close, um, I don't know what I would do without this girl. I she makes my life well ever since she's been in my life, um, everything has changed. Like she's such she's such a big impact on my life and I love her and um she's my best friend and um remember we used to we used to we used to tell her more, but things didn't work out. Um but um So I recently met this girl, her name is Abby, and um, I am I'm afraid to go, and um, yeah, this is her, she goes to my school and stuff, and um, she's a very special girl to me, and she makes me happy, and um, I'm not gonna go into details of what's going on between me and her, but um, she makes me happy, and I absolutely love her. And Abby, I really don't know what I would do without you. And um, fact, oh wait, fear number eight. I think it's eight. Um, so this was one of my fears. But it happened. So, um, I recently lost this, lost her. Um, she passed away a couple weeks ago, last week actually. Um, she had cancer, and, um, one of my fears was losing her. She was really close to me, she was one of my dad's friends. I used to volunteer with her um, for the last two years, three or four years I volunteered with her, and she, she was suffering, she was not in a good place, so if she's in a good place and that I'm happy that she's up in heaven and um, I'm, she's in a better place right now, so I know that's good, so. So that was my last fear. I thought I had more. I was like thinking for like five minutes and um, couldn't think of anything, any more of them. So that was my video this week. And um, 